welcome to Green Dwellings. Come on in. I'll give you a little tour. We set out to accomplish uh, something that no one's done in Florida and in the southeast, and that's to do a LEED Platinum modular building that is solar, smart, and sustainable. So as we look around here, this home was brought, was produced in three months and installed in one day. And it's made out of 18 gauge steel and concrete so that we have no problems with all the things that bother us here in the tropics. That is moisture and bugs and mold and also hurricanes built to the highest state county standards. So the house was brought here in three modules, 57 feet long and about 16 feet across and 12 feet uh, heights in the main room. Everything that could be fixed, meaning it didn't shake, we had installed at the factory where we have less waste at a factory, probably 40% less waste in building time because we have no environmental issues to worry about. We can build around the clock. So everything you see, the hood, the windows, the cabinetry, this was all installed and brought here in day one. So as you can see, there's a lot of natural lighting, which we tried to incorporate. We wanted passive solar things going on. So hopefully you don't have to turn on the lights very much. We designed a lot of light to the back, assuming that's where your privacy is going to be. But even on the side, you can see the clear stories, which are included to add that natural light. And everything you see here is recycled from the tile on the floor, which is coming out of Miami. So there's no CO2 footprint from Miami, or very little. Rollings is developing a whole line of residential and commercial buildings. This was the first prototype. This is 2,500 square feet. And it's about 2,000 under air. And everybody wants to know, well, how much is it? Well, we're building at about $270 a square foot for this one. But we're also coming out with a series of mini houses and going up to 4,000 square feet. They'll all have the same sustainable, renewable materials, uh, the, and we'll have all low flow fixtures, dual flush toilets, and uh, the same in the walk in showers. We will have uh, low flow fixtures in here too. This is the heart of our solar system. On the roof, we have 2,047 watts of PV panels. We also have a big hot water panel. The hot water panel supplies the heat into this 80 gallon tank. And to show that we don't use electricity, I have thrown the breaker on the breaker box. So just so we're, we're doing energy calculations and we wanna know exactly what's being run by the sun. Here's our inverter, which could be located outside, but um, it's good for the tour. And it has a graph on here showing the extra energy we're making. And right now we're selling our extra energy back to FPNL in the zero net metering plan. In the future, we are going to have a storage battery. I'm working with Elon Musk of Tesla fame, and he has a new home storage battery that we're in line for. Then the extra energy used here will be stored on the wall and then we can use it at night to supply and we'll be completely off the grid. And the goal is off the grid. We're close, but not quite there yet. We're very proud of our LEED Platinum Award. All of our homes, all of our commercial buildings, we're gonna be working on storefronts, motels, townhouses, they will all be LEED certifiable. Now, if you take this building and put it in the middle of the Everglades or in a mangrove field, you are not going to get those points. But the buildings themselves will be certifiable. This is another award that we won last year, Sustainable Florida um, Best Practice Award for Sustainable Green Building. And in order to make it sustainable, we also have to be concerned about healthy homes. So when you create this very tight room in a house, that's not really healthy. So we have to add fresh air, which we have an extra dehumidifier, and then put it into a high sear HVAC system. We also worry about toxic paints, toxic chemicals in our closets. All of this has to be traced back and proven that they are, there's no volatile chemicals in any of it. And here we are outside. This is our water collection system. It's coming off the roof. This is a 500 gallon tank. It's automatically feeding into our it drip lines, into our bedwork. 
we have two of these, that's 1,000 gallons of water that would have been lost that we supplement our irrigation system with. It also has an overflow just in case we have too much rain. I encourage everyone to support the West Palm Beach Green Business Challenge. I think it's really a beneficial program and we should all get on board. I'd also like to invite anybody back to Green Dwellings and visit and I'd be happy to give you a tour and talk about ideas that we can make this a better place.